calculate the current through 5 ohm resistor by using superposition theorem. We have to calculate the current through this 5 ohm resistor using superposition theorem. Solution First we will consider this 15 volt voltage source and turn off all other sources. So consider 15 volt voltage source and turn off all other sources. Now if we turn off this voltage source, so this will be short circuit. Now according to the polarity of this voltage source, the current will flow in this direction. Let's say this is current I prime. Now we have to find this I prime. So by using current division rule, by using current division rule, let's say this is total current I. So by using current division rule, I prime is equal to total current into parallel branch or opposite branch resistance. The opposite branch to this 5 ohm is 15 ohm. So 15 ohm divided by same 15 ohm then plus 5 ohm. So first we have to find this I to find the value of I prime. So here we can see this 5 ohm and 15 ohm are connected in parallel. So 5 ohm parallel with 15 ohm this will be 5 into 15 divided by 5 plus 15. Phi into 15 divided by 5 plus 15. So it is 3.75. 3.75 ohm. Now we can replace these two resistors by 7 3.75 ohm. So this will be 3.75 ohm. Now we can easily find the value of current I using Ohm's law. I is equal to V by R. V is 15 volt and R is 10 plus 3.75. So this will be 15 divided by 10 plus 3.75. It is 1.09, 1.09 ampere is the value of total current I. But we have to find I prime. I prime is equal to total current. Now total current value is 1.09 into 15 divided by 15 plus 5. So therefore I prime is equal to 1.09 into 15 divided by 15 plus 5. So it is 0 0.817. 0 0.817 ampere. Now next we have to find I double prime by considering this 10 volt voltage source and turning off all other sources. So now this time we will consider this 10 volt voltage source. Consider 10 volt voltage source and turn off all other sources. So 
now if we turn off this 15 volt voltage source so this will be short circuit now according to the polarity of this voltage source the current will flow in this direction so let's say this is i double prime and this is total current i now again by using by using current division rule current division rule i double prime is equal to total current i into parallel branch resistance parallel resistance to this 5 ohm is 10 divided by 10 plus 5 So this will be, first we have to find this total current I. Now here we can see this 5 ohm and 15 ohm, 5 ohm and this 10 ohm are in parallel. 5 ohm and 10 ohm are in parallel. So this will be 5 into 10 divided by 5 plus 10. 5 into 10 divided by 5 plus 10. So it is 3.33. 3.33 ohm. Now we can replace these two resistors by 3.33 ohm resistor. point 3, 3 ohm. Now we can easily find the value of current I using Ohm's law. I is equal to V by R. Now V here is 10 and R is 3.33 plus 15. So therefore I is equal to 10 divided by 3.33 plus 15. 10 divided by 3.33 plus 15. So it is 0.545 ampere. But we have to find I double prime. I double prime is equal to total current I. Total current I value is 0. 545 0.545 into 10 divided by 10 plus 5 so therefore i double prime is equal to 0 0.545 into 10 divided by 10 plus 5 so it is 0 0.36 0 0.363 ampere now the direction for this I double prime is here we can see the direction for I double prime is downward. So this will be downward and the direction for I prime the direction for I prime is upward. So here we can see both the current directions are opposite. So what we will do we will subtract higher current minus lower current so i prime value is 0 0.817 and i double prime is 0 0.363 so we can get the value of i i 5 ohm we have to find current through 5 ohm register so i 5 ohm is equal to higher current value that is i prime minus lower current value that is i double prime we are do doing subtraction here because the current directions are opposite. That's why we are subtracting higher current minus lower current. So the value for I prime is 0 0.817. 0 0.817 minus I double prime. I double, I double prime is 0 0.363. So therefore I 
i phi u ohm is equal to 0 0.817 0 0.817 minus 0 0.363 so it is 0 0.454 0 0.454 ampere and the direction will be of i prime that is the direction for i prime is upward so the direction will be upward so what we have to find we have to find calculate the current through phi ohm resistor by using superposition theorem so the current through phi ohm resistor is 0 0.454 ampere this is the final answer